Hey, here's two quick ways to animate your text in Premiere Pro. Get your text how you want it arranged, and for effect one, apply a directional blur to it. Drag out the blur length to 1000 and make a keyframe. Move forward a little bit and make another keyframe by dropping the blur length back down to zero. Right click on that new keyframe and hit ease out to make the animation just a bit smoother and that's it. For the second effect, let's kick it up a notch. Go to your effects panel and add basic 3D. And while we're at it, we're also gonna add a crop effect. Go to the basic 3D layer and make a keyframe at the beginning of the timeline for tilt and then type in 2x75. Move to the same place the directional blur ended and set it to zero, and make that keyframe ease out like you did the last one. If you click on crop in your control panel, it'll pull up the dimensions of the crop for you. Like you might guess, the crop hides anything that isn't inside it, so drag the horizontal sides of that crop to line up with the first letter. Now take a minute to make one track for each letter or object you want to move independently by right clicking here and hitting add track a bunch of times. For me, that's eight tracks, seven for Sonduck and one for film. Now make copies of your original text in each track. You can do this by holding Alt or Option and dragging the layer to where you want it. As you drag them, offset them by four frames by moving your time indicator with your arrow keys. Now for the last part. For the sake of your workflow, move your time indicator to a point towards the end of the animation of all the layers, and now go one by one and adjust the crops so they're each on their own respective letter or section. This may feel like it's a lot, but it takes no time at all to get the hang of. Once you've adjusted the last segment, trim or adjust the ends so that they all end at the same time and the effect is done. If you don't like how messy the timeline looks now, you can select all of those layers you just made and make a nest for them like this. Now you can even apply more effects on top of it like glow for example. And those were just two quick ways to animate text in Premiere. Hope you had fun watching and I'll see you next time. If you're looking to save time and produce awesome work right here in After Effects in Premiere Pro, check out our links below to get access to our Motion Duck extension, which contains thousands of editable templates that are easy to update and ready to go for any commercial, client, and personal project.